lava. Uh, all right, we are back. Cecily Strong from Schmigadoon, season two. How you doing, Melissa? I'm good because it's a Cosmo and it was top heavy. Okay, <laughs> all right, okay. But did you stain my rug? I did not, no, it was light, I'm okay. sorry. Okay. You know light I'm the first Cosmo. one to stain your rug, right? I got a, I got a Sharpie on it once. Oh, you did? Yeah, I like season yes. three. Oh. We, you know, we've had a lot of stains on the rug. Yeah, but mine was And it was always a ankles, it always rankles me, yes. <laughs> the ankles. But, um, but you, you know stressed. what the good news is? We've been here 14 years, and I forgot that you did that okay. with her, you know what I mean? Oh, We're good. I got a Sharpie on your rug. Okay, that's fine. It was yeah. shocking news. And Margaret Joseph just texted me and said, you're being very rough on me tonight. Who said that? Who? Margaret. Oh, She's really? She's like, oof, Andy's killing you tonight. Um, she texted me and said, I want to explain the story about oh, Laura to Oh, did she? Okay, yes, good. Yes, I go, I got it. Why are you I being mean it. to okay. me? <laughs> I'm not being mean to you, but I'm, you know, we ask the questions. Okay, whatever. Okay, all right. Do you feel like I'm giving you too hard of a time tonight? I mean, no, I'm willing to answer your questions. Okay. Joe, am I being too hard on your wife tonight? No, uh, no, answer those questions. Come okay. on, baby, right. let's go. The answer. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of thought he I was mean, gonna have your back there. It's all right? negative. Yeah. Uh, uh, to these Quinn questions, you're all Siri Dahl are from the documentary yeah. Money Shot, the porn up story now streaming on Netflix. Let's go back to our fans. Jennifer and Matthew from New Jersey have a question for Cecily. Hey, you two. Hi, Andy. How are you doing? Hi, Cecily. Hi. <laughs> what is your, Cecily, what's your favorite memory from having Austin Butler and Lizzo as your last uh, guest for SNL? Well, I mean, you got serenaded. I got serenaded. It's going to have to be that. It's like having Elvis serenaded. Right. Well, no, but he also sang an Elvis song. To Which you. he yes. didn't want to do, too. Really? That was, the, I mean, not because of me. Yeah, he right. just didn't want to sing as Elvis and... That's the one thing Lauren asked of him. And he did it, so I guess we're in love. Right. <laughs> it happens. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. So what, do, what, I mean, was that your favorite moment of the episode? Was that a surprise to you? It, that week, it, I mean, it wasn't like a surprise surprise. That week right. it was, and I hadn't read the, the sketch that Colin wrote, so I didn't know what they were gonna say, so it was very sweet. Yes. I have the tape of the table read. Wow. Or tape, I guess it's not a tape. Well, no, I'm with you, yes. <laughs> okay. Whatever they put things on. Let's go to Blair from Indianapolis with a question for Melissa. Hi, Andy, Melissa, and Cecily. Hey. Hi. Uh, Melissa, what was your reaction when you heard Teresa say that Joe needs therapy and you have daddy issues? <laughs> you know, that was, I mean, my father passed away when right. I was 16. So, I, I mean, I, I, I like to be the only one who says I have daddy issues if I'm right. gonna say it. I don't really wanna hear anyone else say. You know, I would never say anything like that about, you know, my father-in-law and her. Like, you know, I just, uh, you know, I was 16 Girl. when, right. you know, yeah. so. Right. Yeah, I just think that like, if someone's gonna say they have daddy issues, it should come from my own mouth and I right. should explain my story that way. Well, by the way, I mean, that's kind of a rough, blanket to put on someone who lost their father when they were 16. Right. right. And 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 God forbid if I ever said something like that when you know when she lost him when she was yeah. almost 50, right. it would be like hell froze right. over. But like I was a 16 year old girl, you know, my father never met my kids, never met my husband. Yeah. You know, I raised myself when it comes to that. <coughs> so you know I think you don't even have to explain it. It's yeah. not a yeah. nice I will say this, it, and it seemed clear since BravoCon and before, and since you stopped filming this season, I mean, what is clear is that you're kind of done with each other in a way. I mean, it's, you know, I mean, you're, but there I think seems we've hit to the be. Point. We, hit the, we hit the point of like, we realize it's just, we try. I, right. I know I, I've tried. But you seem to have a clarity and a calm about you relating to that, that, maybe is a relief in some way? Oh, for sure. It's such a relief because all I ever wanted to do was please and try to be accepted by the family and not, I could never understand why I wasn't and I never understood why if the son is so happy or the brother is so happy, why isn't everyone else so happy that like the house is clean and the kids are good and they're in love? Like I never understood it and I was always just like, what am I doing wrong? What am yeah. I doing wrong? And then I stopped worrying about what I'm doing wrong and realized that like I need to live my life and my husband's happy and I'm happy and my children are happy and and you know, 
What do you think? Can I, what do you think changed? Because I feel like you've put up with so much. I feel like you've kept showing up for years and years. So what do you think changed for you? I think that you know enough. when when oh. Teresa came out of prison, we spent a lot of time with her. When Joe went in, she spent a lot of time with Joe and I, with whoever she was dating or seeing or whatever was going on. Her kids, the drama. Joe and I really stepped up to the plate with talking to them when they were feeling certain ways. And it's just, obviously, everyone's saying that's not true, which is fine. But I feel like recently when she got content and happy and found her life, it was like, well, thank you so much, bye-bye. And where I thought it was gonna be complete opposite. I thought it was like, now I'm on, we got this all together and he loves me too. Like, that's what we thought. <clears throat> it seems like we're back to square one in terms of she's mad that you came on the show. We're basically, we're literally I mean, we're talking still about, talking mm -hmm. about how you got on the show. Wait, is nobody baffled that we're talking about 2010 because yeah. that's the year Joey was born and he was two months old at his christening? So, I'm baffled and that we're discussing us with the wedding stuff, whatever, whatever. We're, we're talking about 2010, not about the last 10 years that we've been together and had dinners and Christmases and Easter's and birth. What, what happened? <laughs> uh, what happened? Because I, I don't know. Why are we talking about the tweets? We already knew those tweets. My sisters, my, my sister-in-law, we've had beautiful dinners and get togethers and when she needed someone to meet Louis because she needed to introduce him to family, guess whose family? It was my mom and my sisters mm. making him dinner. Mm. And he loved them all. Got haircuts from my brother. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I'm clueless. Yeah. Clueless as what, ha I don't know. It's right. we're back to like, well, when you got on the show. Right. And I'm like, but we passed that and we discussed that 50 times. So we've got the reunion in a week. Scary. That's. I'm gonna sleep the day before. I decided. Like, I don't want to know anything. I want to sleep the whole day. I want to be very prepared. I want to like have my receipts this time because I haven't felt like I need to have receipts in a very long time. But I feel like there's a lot of accusations that aren't true. There's a lot of twists and turns, and they haven't done that in a while. There's a lot of like, I need to prove a lot, which I'm, I'm so upset about. I'm trying to figure out how 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 deep we go because go deep it seems done no, no, go you deep. all seem done i mean no we're not done no i, I agree who's done? like how deep not done who's i mean done? you seem you all seem complete in your no, no, no. resolution to Listen, move on from each other we're not, that's what we're i'm not saying complete. That's in fair. other words i don't feel that i'm going to get any kind of resolution out of the reunion and that's, that's what fair I'm because you're not a therapist right are right. you certified well, I mean, uh, okay, well, let's not question my credentials. I'm just saying, okay. I, I don't know, yes. are you? Yes, I'm certified. You are? Well, no, but after 16 years of I doing this, I are. think I have some idea of what I'm doing. Okay, okay. okay. You, no, you are, you're technically a therapist, no, I I, but like, you know better than to, to try to work with us, right? No, right? No, like the Jersey fam yes. and the therapy, you, sometimes uh, it yes. works. It's never done, it's it. never done. It's family, bro. What do you walk okay. away from family? Come on, what's the matter with you? What are we, All animals? Right. Okay, here we are. Okay. What are we, animals? Wow, You're I never done. Okay, well, you just got me resolute. Oh, now. Jesus. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but like. Cecily, you want to come? Yeah. 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 I would like you just to have like an ear thing and I'll put the little piece in my ear and you can Same just military. give me funny lines. You don't need, I think you're yeah. good. I think you're I good. have all my answers. Are you ready good. to go now? I want to go tonight. No, I'm not ready. I'm not I want to go right now. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> okay. I got my uh, dress hanging. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah. Um, Cecily, I come in pajamas. To see you. Great to see you. Yes. <laughs> Back um, I hope to see you soon and congratulations on the show. So thank you, ladies. I'll see you soon. Good luck. Good luck. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.